A blast from the past was on site at Burlington Center over the weekend. A pop-up at the mall was put on by the Burlington Historical Society. Alan Harrington, who serves on the Burlington Historical Society's board, said the pop-up is just one of the outreach events the group does. So we started about 1960. We have a meeting every second Monday of the month. Uh, from from uh, September through to May, and we have excellent speakers that come by and tell bit different stories. We're trying to find the history of Burlington and share that story to the people, uh, most uh, stories of people's lives and so on, how they were, how they lived here and what they experienced. The pop-up at the mall featured numerous tidbits of what Burlington used to be. One of them was on the history of Burlington's waterfront. You know the area today is Spencer Smith Park. This is the Brant Inn that we talked about. A lot of great musicians played here over the years. You can see on this side of it, this all water. This was a breakwater on this side. The breakwater was eventually filled in with, with soil, and that's where we have our rib fest and our sound of music to this day. So you can still see that hill is along there, but it's all covered in dirt now. This is the old cannery factory where they process tomatoes or tomatoes in the old day. Another picture of the same cannery and the water uh, front. Just one of the best parts about Burlington is being by the water. Another display showed how people in Burlington lived back in the day. This tells a little bit of the story of what was like in the daily life here. We have a planing mill with uh, horses in the snow. We have um, a gentleman here at the Victoria restaurant, a famous guest was Louis Armstrong, who was here and had lunch before he played at the at the Brant Inn we spoke about. Uh, some churches, florists, everybody lived here, everybody uh, spent their lives here, went to school, went to church. The group also sells various resources, such as books and videos on Burlington's history. Those who want to learn more about the Burlington Historical Society can... Come to our meeting, second Monday, it's at the Central Library on New Street. It starts at 7 p.m., we're down about 8.30. Uh, you can become a member. You can go on our website, which is uh, burlingtonhistorical.ca, and you can see all kinds of good things on there. Lots of photographs and archives, and uh, we're always looking for new volunteers that can help even on social media, painting, drawing, writing stories, doing our newsletter. There's lots of opportunity for, for people to want to help. For Halton News in Burlington, I'm Edward Jan.